Hi everyone, uh, I'm Anna. I'm one of the vets here at South Paws. Um, I'm here to provide you with an update on Hugo. Hugo is a nine-year-old male neutered grudel. Um, he had his femoral head and neck um, excision surgery that was live streamed earlier today. Um, so this is Hugo's pre-operative radiographs. Um, we can see on the left hand side um, uh, he has a he had a um, heat luxation and and also bilaterally we can see um, severe end stage um, degeneration and remodeling of the acetabulum and um, the femoral femoral head and the femoral neck um, a lot of osteophyte um, formation um, and if we were to draw an imaginary line here so we can see that there's much less than 50% overlap between the um, dorsal rim of the acetabulum and the femoral head. Um, so moving on to the post-operative radiographs. Um, so we can see that the excision has been performed um, from the medial aspect of the greater trochanter to the proximal aspect of the lesser trochanter. And this limits bony um, contact between the femoral head and the um, acetabulum. And then um, eventually this will form a false joint and um, enable the patient to walk. So in terms of post-op care, um, Hugo will undergo two weeks of exercise restrictions. Um, so, but we'll um, encourage him to walk on leash uh, with sling support as soon as um, possible. Um, and this is to prevent contraction of hip muscles. Um, and this is a problem that we find in patients that have remained uh, recumbent uh, for a long time after surgery. So uh, we try to prevent that as much as possible. Um, so physiotherapy and hydrotherapy um, two weeks post um, uh, surgery is highly recommended. Uh, we also um, ice the surgical site um, for the first couple of days and we do it every four hours when they are in hospital. In terms of pain relief, um, Hugo right now he's on a four micrograms per kilograms uh, per hour of fentanyl CRI. Um, with the plan to transition onto um, codeine one milligram per kilogram uh, per hour, um, twice a day for seven days, and also um, caprofen two milligrams per kilograms per hour, um, once a day for ten days, and um, we plan for him to come back for a two week recheck where we can remove um, the sutures and also um, in eight weeks time just to assess his uh, ambulation. Yep, that's it. Thank you.